it's Madison and welcome to or welcome back to my channel where today we're back on Imperial SMP for the next episode. Now this episode is kind of being made in between the last episode to like while I'm in the middle of making it because it's Christmas time and I'm still working on this darn castle. Um, so uh, pay no mind to <laughs> to that. Um, it's, it's, it's almost done, I promise. Uh, but I can't show you too much, but there's a sneak peek. For the next episode, which will actually be the castle, yes. Um, but it's Christmas, which means um, we're gonna decorate just a little bit, which means put a few can of canes, maybe get some snow up in here. Luckily, we have snow like right beside us, and we are gonna do Secret Santa. Let us just uh, talk about Secret Santa, okay? Let's let's just talk about that for a minute. You know, you get you get someone, you give them a gift. And let me just tell you who I got. I don't even know if I have the piece of paper on me. But do you know who we got? None other than go number four. Who murdered our horse. <laughs> Poor toadstool. Murdered. <sighs> so, I have decided, in the name of Christmas, I will give him a gift. Because obviously that is part of Secret Santa. But, I will make him work for it. So, we're gonna give him a box full of coal. And then, we're gonna have him look for his present because... <laughs> Why not, you know? All in the name of Christmas. We love that, right? Uh, it also looks like we have some kind of present here, so let's see what this is. I don't know what this is. This wasn't here when I was on earlier. It said, I can barely read this. Happy holidays, Madison. Hope it's useful. <gasps> Holy crap. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's a whole shulker and a shulker box, actually. Of This is great because I have a giant mushroom to build on that castle up there. This is wonderful. So, and it comes in pink, so I'm wondering if Brooke got it for us or if this was our secret Santa. I don't know, but this is freaking amazing. So, thank you. Well, we just made a wooden shovel because I'm too lazy to walk all the way back over there to get one. To get, you know, a real shovel. I don't even know how much. Does he have a pumpkin head on? Good for him. So now, we plop you on there and make you into a derpy little snowman. And we'll make you into a derpy little snowman. Derpy snowman. Oh, this guy's already been at work. Look at him go. Our snowman hard at work. I love it. Now let's sleep before they get killed in the night because that's probably bound to happen. Okay, so now we have some red and white candy canes so we can decorate just a little bit. Or red and white concrete, I mean. Oh yeah, those look cute. Especially with snow everywhere. So, we have put out some candy canes and the snow golems to get our snow around. So now it's looking extra Christmassy to get us in the Christmas spirit before we go and give go number four coal. And a quest to find an actual present, which won't be much, but so cute. I love it. Okay, so I have uh, looked through my chest for any uh, valuables that we may have, which isn't a lot. Christmas on a budget. Okay, so we're gonna head over to Brooks Portal so we can use use that and go find Go Number Four's place, and then we'll leave him his scavenger hunt. Okay, so we're back here. It's brought up some terrible memories. Let's uh, get down here carefully. Ow, or break my leg. Our lectern's still there, so... Is there anywhere to sleep here? Because I'd rather not die. Let's uh, see if there's a bed. What in the... What? What in my... I feel like I'm in some creepy ritual place. I'm gonna leave now. All I wanted is a bed. So we'll start here. And then we don't have a sign on us. Inside, we'll leave our four coal blocks. And then we'll just use all the coal that we <laughs> have. It says, hello, this is your secret Santa, and after the actions I've seen you cause, horse murder, I have decided to give you coal. Okay, not entirely because Christmas is a season of giving, but I have decided you must hunt for your true present. So prepare for a small hunt. Next stop, your sugarcane farm. Pretty simple, right? He'll hopefully see this. And he'll go right here to where his auto sugarcane farm is 
And I'll be like, hmm, okay, I don't see anything, but it'll be right here. And currently has nothing in it. So that's where we have to go. So I know he has a neighbor around here somewhere. I just don't remember which direction. Oh, maybe it's over this way. Okay, holy crap. There's so much stuff over here. Whoa. Oh, this is so cool. Whose area is this? I forgot. But there's Gru. There's like stuff from Bikini Bottom. There's the Tangled Tower. I love it. So now we're done. This one says look into the original chest. So when it gets to this one, it'll say look under the original chest and it'll actually be under the first chest. <laughs> But, um, we're gonna put it inside, uh, Patrick's rock here. Well, I came from this way, didn't I? Or no, did I come from over there? Hold on. One moment, I'm lost. In the first one, he'll have coal, and then a book that leads him to this chest in here, hopefully. And then this one will say, Small cave under your spruce trees. We're just gonna put some random seeds in there, because why not? That one will lead all the way this way to this little sprucey area right here, which I would assume is his. I could be terribly wrong, but I would assume. And then this one will say, Patrick Star lives in Imperial. And then that'll lead to Patrick Star, which I'm not about to go over there. Inside Patrick Star's rock, he'll find the one that says, go look under the original chest. And under the original chest, there's gonna be the chest with the actual prize in it actual present Christmas on a budget so okay so the this book says you found it congrats Merry Christmas and happy holidays Christmas is a little bit on a budget this year as I am broke but nonetheless hope you enjoyed the super small adventure heart secret Santa so that is the end of go number four's quest and I just gave him a bunch of random things some golden apples some emeralds some mini blocks some copper glow ink sacks yeah. And then I replaced that one of the potatoes with Toadstool the horse. That's the end of this, uh, this Christmas episode. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. Comment down below what you thought of our secret Santa and our decorated area. And as always, hit that subscribe button. Join the Corgi Squad and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!